The arms race between major nations has never stopped, but what's holding the top spot in the naval arms race now? With China's maritime power rapidly growing, the US Navy has introduced a never-before-seen advanced weapon, laser technology. A super-destructive weapon, leaving nothing but ruins where it strikes. But what makes this weapon so special, and how can it change the face of modern warfare? The answer will surprise you. Let's dive in and find out. The arms race between the US and China has never ceased. Every time the US unveils a weapon, China counters with something similar. So is this technology unique to these two nations, or just a copy and upgrade? China is continuously bolstering its naval strength, boasting superior numbers and a dominant presence in the South China Sea. This poses a huge challenge for the US. How do you counter an opponent with superior numbers? Not to mention their cutting-edge weaponry, like the DF-1D and DF-26 anti-ship ballistic missiles. With its vast number of warships and fighter planes at sea, China's ambition to dominate the South China Sea is evident. Given the strength of China's navy, we often see Chinese warships attacking fishing boats from neighboring countries. Is this a drill, a weapons test, or outright suppression aiming to seize control of the South China Sea? China's ambition to become the dominant naval force is clear. But the US won't stand idly by. As one of the world's most developed nations with cutting-edge technology, the US has been closely monitoring China's moves. In response, the US Navy doesn't rely on numbers, but rather on superior quality and technology. The answer lies in the Arla Burr-class destroyers, the most advanced in the world, with enhanced designs and firepower, making them sea monsters. The Arla Burke is one of the largest and most modern ships in the US fleet, equipped with cutting-edge weapons, allowing the US Navy to confront any enemy, especially a brazen China causing havoc at sea. If a day comes when the Chinese and US navies meet on the ocean, what will happen? Will there be a war, and if so, who will win? The Arla Burr-class destroyers are among the most important ships in the US Navy. As the face of the Navy, they are meticulously designed and built, making them powerful and formidable forces on the water. Arla Burr-class destroyers aren't just regular warships. They are true sea monsters, capable of multi-mission warfare, including air defense, anti-submarine, and surface attacks. Any enemy that encounters them is bound to be terrified. Equipped with a vertical launch system, the LS capable of holding up to 96 missiles, from land attack Tomahawk missiles to SM-6 air defense missiles, Arla Burke can destroy enemies in the air, underwater, and on land. This isn't just power, it's the integration of advanced technology, allowing the US Navy to adapt to any threat. With its massive size, it can house an array of weapons, especially missiles. As you know, the destructive power of a missile is unparalleled. If a battle were to occur, the Arla Burke's firepower could easily destroy enemy ships or shoot down aerial targets in no time, showcasing the ship's unmatched strength. And there's one super special weapon, capable of obliterating an aircraft with a single strike, the laser weapon, a futuristic technology, and the US military's weapon of the future. What makes this special is the advanced laser technology on the USS Preble. This is the first US Navy ship equipped with the Helios laser system, a 60 kilowatt laser weapon capable of destroying drones, small boats, and even disrupting enemy sensors. With its destructive power, the laser weapon can easily defeat opponents, and when combined with other weapons, it gives a massive advantage. The Helios System High Energy Laser with Integrated Optical Dazzler and Surveillance is a significant breakthrough in US Navy weapons technology. Helios not only brings incredible power with its ability to destroy small targets like drones and boats, but also features intelligence by integrating optical sensors to track and engage with high precision. One of Helios' most special and intelligent features is its ability to blind enemy optical sensors. 
This means it's not just a destructive weapon, but also a tool to disrupt missile and aircraft guidance systems. By using powerful lasers, Helios can jam or destroy sensors on enemy warships, aircraft, or missiles, rendering them incapable of targeting accurately. This is a strategic weapon in modern warfare, where sensor and guidance technology plays a crucial role in identifying targets and executing precise attacks. For instance, if a long-range missile is heading toward a U.S. warship, Helios can fire its laser to blind the sensors on the warhead, causing the missile to lose its path or fail to complete its attack. This provides the Navy with an additional layer of defense beyond traditional intercept missiles. Currently, Helios has a power of 60 kilowatts, enough to destroy drones, small boats, and blind enemy sensors. However, in the future, this power will be upgraded to 150 kilowatts, a figure large enough not only to counter small targets, but also to take down low-flying cruise missiles and hypersonic missiles. Hypersonic missiles are one of the most challenging threats any nation faces because they travel at speeds many times the speed of sound, making detection and interception extremely complicated. But with 150 kilowatts laser technology, Helios can target these missiles from a distance and destroy them before they reach their intended targets. Unlike traditional missile defense systems, laser weapons like Helios don't have to worry about running out of ammunition, as energy can be continuously supplied by the integrated system on the warship. This gives a significant tactical advantage, especially in prolonged battles or when facing multiple waves of enemy attacks. With plans to upgrade Helios power, the US Navy is moving towards a new era of warfare technology. Directed energy weapons do systems like Helios not only reduce the cost of defending against airborne and naval threats, but also greatly enhance the Navy's precision defense and attack capabilities. Laser weapons are revolutionizing how nations protect warships and deal with modern threats. With major advancements in high-energy technology, Helios will continue to be a key part of the U.S. Navy's combat strategies in the near future. And what does the future hold? The U.S. Navy is developing the DDGX Destroyer, an entirely new design capable of carrying even more powerful laser weapons and hypersonic missiles. This will be the first ship designed from the ground up with the goal of integrating high-energy weapons technology and hypersonic weaponry. DDGX isn't just another warship, it's a mobile fortress with the destructive power to take down hypersonic missiles traveling at speeds of up to Mach 5. All of this is housed within a ship designed for extreme durability and survivability. So what sets the US Navy apart from the rest of the world? It's the combination of cutting-edge technology, flexible strategies, and superior defensive power. Laser technology and the DDGX Destroyer won't just change how the U.S. Navy fights, but will reshape the entire landscape of global naval warfare. While China continues to grow in numbers, the U.S. has responded with technology. And it's these technologies that will ensure the U.S. Navy maintains its dominant position well into the 21st century. If the U.S. and China were to face off in the South China Sea with the current naval technology of the U.S., China would have very little chance of winning. This demonstrates the unparalleled strength of the U.S. Navy and military, armed with the world's most advanced weapon systems, making it easy for the U.S. to defeat any adversary. With laser technology and, and next-gen warships, the U.S. Navy is ushering in a new era of naval warfare. Will this technology be enough to maintain America's number one position in the arms race? What are your thoughts on laser weapons at sea? Let us know in the comments below. If you found this video interesting, don't forget to like and subscribe to stay up to date on the latest in military technology. Thanks for watching.